Uh, welcome back to Elvis Douglas channel and this is your boy Elvis. Uh, today I was looking to an error I had when I was working on my Laravel project. Uh, so uh, this issue comes on with the PHP Addison serve. So to run your project after building a button, maybe working on some part. Uh, usually this doesn't mean if you're using only Laravel but when your composer is not working out very well or when you open your terminal and you run composer and doesn't work so this is the way you solve it so we're going to go through step by step just follow along so that you can fix the same issue uh, so if i'm to run composer and i say run so a person you you get something like this here you don't go for install for me only you go for install for all users recommended so when you click it so you get something like this uh, developer mode is somehow sophisticated uh, you go to do most stuff manually so we're not going to go for that uh, right now we're going to go for something just to show you how you you do this so that your your content can work out very well for you this issue disturbs a lot and very many times when you run your composer you cannot see it tells you it's not recognized or something like that in the project tells you bash command no found as i wrote on the notepad there but now when you go for next so right now for me my command line is correct now it's linking to my php but now i'm going to show you how it's done so if i come to zam then here down i'm having a pro a, a folder with the name php so when i go through there is this extension here so i click on it and i go for open so i'm linking my composer to my php file so when i go for next uh, you have to leave this blank so each and everything will be shown to you immediately and you go for install right now for me i'm having it already installed on my system and it's working out so after the installation everything will be well off so for me now let me just show you something real quick uh, so if i go for cmd even though it's not uh let me say if usually some people go for run as admin but now if the composer is working out you are able to say how to type composer and if you run it will show you each and everything working out very well like this so no need of running as administrator something like that everything will be working out very well yeah so that's how you organize your content to run composer and again if you are using your cmd you have to reopen a new cmd so that you are able to run compose again it will work out and then if you're having a project which is already open just reboot or restart your project it will work out thank you please like and subscribe to elvis douglas channel thank you it's caught in the crossfire <laughs>